Good afternoon, my friends. Um, I'm just looking through this. This is the uh, classical guitar repertoire list from the University of West London. It's 2018, it's a little bit out of date, but you know, more or less same sort of stuff. Now, as most of you know, I can't read music and most uh, guitarists from a rock pop background don't, but I do love classical music and um, you know, the highest it goes up to, as you can see, is grade eight here. And um, you'll see that I've done Cavatina on my previous stuff, so I can get up there with the, with uh, with these chaps, you know, uh, to a point. You know, I wouldn't say I was the best at it, but I'm not bad. Um, Caprico, I can do Cavatina, but there's one track that's missing off these lists, um, a, a track by Torrega, because in my opinion, the pick that it, it uses uh, to play it, the pick you need to know, is the hardest pick in the world it, it just is you know um it puts shredding and all that sort of stuff it's like first year stuff doing all that it really is and I, i'm not very good at shredding either two reasons one i don't like it um and two i don't like it you know uh but the pick that i in question is called the tremolo and it's a really really difficult thing to play and i'm going to quickly give you a, a, a little overview of, of why it's so difficult i've been trying to do it for years and i'm still struggling i can teach recuerdos de la alhambra to to no perfect but i can't play it because i'm just not good enough yet to do it and i'm going to show you why all right the pick feature is like this i'll try and i'll just do it with simple chords for now like an a minor Play an A minor, okay, it's a simple A minor, bum, 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 all right? And with your thumb, I want you to count it like this. Group these three fingers on the second string, finger one, finger two, and finger three, okay? Like that, okay? Keep them there, and just do this. Five, four, three, four, three, four. That's all I want you to do. Try another chord, we'll go to a C by just simply moving this third finger to the fifth string of the third fret. Do the same. Five, four, three, four, three, four, five, four, three, four, three, four. Okay, and then go to an E minor. Six, four, three, four, three, four, six, four, three, four, three, four. And then take this third finger, okay? and stick it up there on the bass note and go six, four, three, four, three, four, six, four, three, four, three, four. Now you'll find, when I say E minor, we're not using the fifth string, but put it on anyway, because you might hit that note by mistake. Same with the G. All right, so, so far so good, that's not hard. But every time you strike a bass note, now you're gonna play this after every single bass note. So five, two, 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 and you come from the second, from the from your third finger. It's called Pami P Pulma. I don't know the names of these things. Think of it like this: thumb three two one, thumb three two one. That's the way we would say it, okay? Thumb three two one. And the harder thing is, you've got to play them all on the same string, okay? In this case, the second string. So you'd count it like this: one and two and three. Okay, one and two and three and one and two and three and one and two and three. Let's see, do two bars on each one. play record I think it runs at about 165 160 but practice this pick and a good way to try and get your fingers positioned is to put your three group your three fingers on the second string and then put your thumb in front of those three and just practice this again thumb three two one thumb three two one thumb three two one thumb three just on the same string listen for the percussion and it's got to be constant Try moving your way up the strings. 
It's the hardest pick in the world. It really is. Anyone that says it isn't is talking shit. Because it is. All right. Um, and you've got to practice for years and years and years and years. And maybe I can't do it yet perfectly because I'm getting old. Maybe that's the reason. Maybe it's because I ain't got no fingernails. Maybe it's because I'm a Londoner. No, no I'm a little Um You know what I mean. But give it a go anyway. It's really worth doing anyway just to get your fingers moving. All right. <laughs> I need to practice. I'll catch you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.